Hi, everyone. So today we're going to be talking about the bass clef. Uh, the bass clef is very similar to the treble clef um, in that it gives us a key to sing in. It gives us a frame of reference to where notes lie, etc. But it's very different in the treble clef in that there are different names, uh, note names for the bass clef. Um, so let's take a look at the bass clef. The bass clef looks like this, kind of like a C with two dots uh, right uh, above the fourth line. Uh, this tells us where F is. Just as a treble clef had a different name, it had, treble clef was also known as the G clef, the bass clef is also known as the F clef. So the bass clef tells us where F lies. And then based on that knowledge, we use our previous knowledge, what we learned last time of the musical alphabet, and apply it to the bass clef. So, for example, if here is F, our next uh, note up would be G, our next note up would be A, because we are ascending. We're going this direction, we're ascending, and when we get to G, we're looping back around to A. Um, on the opposite way, we're descending now, so you have E, D, C, B, A, and then G. So all of those notes are in the bass clef. It looks different from the treble clef. Um, so for example, your line notes in the bass clef will be G, B, D, F, and A. And your space notes will be A, C, G, sorry, E, G. A, C, E, G will be your uh, space notes. Uh, so let's go through a couple of these examples down here. So we're taking a look at these notes. We know this is F because we're in the bass clef, the F clef. So I count F, E, D because I'm descending, right? So this would be D. Here is F. I'm ascending going up one. So therefore we see a G, right? Here's the F clef. We start on F, F, pretty basic. Uh, then we go down one, right? We're descending, F, E. So for this one, right? Here is F because we're in bass clef. I am counting down because I'm descending. So this would be F, E, D, C, right? This would be C. Then here's F, G because I'm ascending, right? Going up and also that based on this, and we already established this was G, this is G again. Um, for this next one, we have F, G, A. I'm counting both the lines and the spaces. And then descending, F, E, D. So now this is D. Um, so bass clef and treble clef are similar, but they're also different at the same time. They have a different set of notes. If you just know that the bass clef, the fourth line, where the two dots go around is F, and in the same thing, same vein, in the treble clef, you know where that little loop goes around, you know that's called the G clef, then you'll be able to find any of the notes just by following the musical alphabet. It's super important to memorize this, it's not very hard to memorize, um, and once you kind of get that, you'll be able to name any note on the uh, bass clef or the treble clef. All you need to know is treble clef is G clef, and bass clef is F clef, and know where those G and Fs go. Um, if you have any questions, I'd be glad to answer them. Thank you all for your time. I hope you enjoyed this lesson on bass clef notes. Thanks so much.